the Sandmas. I'm going to use Savannah tree. Then two bastons of gin to give some botanical flavors, particularly the orange ones. One bastion of triple six and two of gum in order to balance the taste. Grapefruit and uh, soda water. Get the essences from the orange out. Try some masses for us. What I'm going to make for you today is the guava blanca. What we have is Havana 3 guava juice. Uh, to counteract that, what I've got is the Jake's Tree cloudy apple. And now we've got the orgeat. So, marzipan almond. So, we've got the gum here. Just give it a little bit better texture, a little bit more smooth when it's going down. Beautiful. You don't have to try it, guys. It's absolutely beautiful. <laughs> don't worry. You can take my word on it. 10 out of 10 all the way. <laughs> Simple, easy, a van of three cocktail made of flower juice. Right, guys, basically more cocktails with a Cubana banana. I'm going to have two bar spoons of banana liqueur. I've got Orgeat here to bring out the marzipan and the slightly almondy flavour. Got a bit of a caramel flavour, just the dot select sauce that they've got in the kitchen. Condensed milk, but this also helps with the kind of consistency of the cocktail. These nozzles are a bit smaller than mine. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't really think what I was saying then, but it is. <laughs> a good old taste. Nice milk chocolate on there. Just gives it the last little bit of aroma. Here we go, guys. That is the Cubana Right, hello, guys. Today I'm going to make you uh, the Montana Blue, <laughs> named after the famous movie Cuban gangster Tony Montana. I'm going to take a two count of uh, the Blue Curico. I want to take this cocktail as, right, as eye patchy as possible. I'll take one bar spoon of coconut syrup. Get Go around the edge of the glass with orange just to add to the blue, blue curico taste. Okay, today I'm going to make a mate mojito or a mate mojito, depending on which part of the country you're from. So the first thing we've got is stem ginger. I'm now going to add mint and then the mate tea. And then the Havana rum, five count. And a three count of lime. Just to make it a little bit different and to differentiate it from mojito as much as anything. Just a little bit of lime zest. Enjoy. Uh, hi guys, I'm Steve and this is Steve. Uh, we're from Leicester and we're going to present to you our cocktail, the Aguacate Prendido, which is the tipsy avocado. It's a fresh, exciting drink that won't just sit alongside the spring summer menu. It'll be a statement of intent for the Las Iguanas Fresh Revolution. Um, I know, it's, it's good. I've thought about this. I've practiced. I've practiced. <laughs> we take a four count of the banana, banana joy. Half a shot of vanilla 43. One bar spoon of gum. Just to add a bit of sweetness to it. And then we use apple juice. 50 ml. Get a good half shake for about 20 seconds. Just to make sure the mix is nice and blended to give it a good texture. Or simply strain over your ice. Well done, guys. My cocktail is called Pina Cubana. It's a tiki style cocktail, so it's got a pineapple base to it. 50ml pineapple juice. Got two count of liquid 43 to bring out the vanilla in the Havana. Two count of lime juice to add some sourness. Finally, for a bit of a kick, got a bar spoon of cinnamon. My drink is the Limonada Cubana, so it's basically um, a twist on Cuban lemonade. A two count of Martini Extra Dry goes really well with lemon, something that we don't really use that much on our cocktail menu. Four count of lemon juice, so again picking up on the citrus flavours that we've got in Havana, bringing that out. 
And to sweeten it up, give it a bit of warmth, make it like less bitter from the lemon. We've got four bar spoons of passion fruit, so I get rid of any bits of the lemon pulp, get a bit of extra lemon oils in there, and then it's rubbed around the outside for the limonade to keep it. So I'm going to be using a Havana Three Year Old Club. Um, I think it's quite a fresh spirit and uh, the cocktail I'm going to make is a really fresh cocktail so I think this is going to go very well. I'm going to do two bar spoons of ginger syrup, 25ml apple juice, 25ml Sauvignon Blanc. And I'm going to do a four count of the Havana Club. Give it a nice shake. Seri <laughs> bitters, Just one drop. That's just going to make it taste really fresh. There you go, guys. Quality of cocktails has been excellent. The judges have had a really tough time of it. First place, uh, fitting a niche on the menu. Uh, really good prospect uh, was Gunwolf Key with their Havana Banana. Thank you very much, and I'm so happy to have won. I'm shocked. Brilliant. Thank you very much, guys.